What's up, guys? It's your boy Wolf. I'm out here with Sav, aka 630. And today is the Kroger's keys to the game. Three things to go from casual to comp and lock. Know the dribble moves. Know, know the combos. Know what the point guard wants to do. What moves are OP, what moves are not. Which way they could dribble out of each hesitation. I know it's kind of in depth, but like the way you get better at that is just one, either playing the game, playing point guard, or playing quick match. Playing the game a lot against a good point guard that could dribble. Like he tells me all the time, you know, this move is better. Like they could do this move on the wing, they can't. I just add that to my game and it, you know, it allows me to like kind of dictate what they want to do. Tip number two will be know your rotations. Know where you got to be on defense. Know if you get beat to the midi, do you have to run to the wing? Do you have to run to the same corner? Where's your, where's your help coming from? That's a big thing for defense and locks in general. Because for me as a point guard, if the rotations are not crisp, when people are guarding me, it's easy to make a pass if somebody rotates late or somebody rotates in the wrong spot. So the rotations definitely got to be crisp or the other opposing point guard can either easily dot it, free corner three, or get a free dunk because somebody didn't rotate down. So rotations are definitely key as a lockdown and defense in general. If you're not there on time, then someone gets a three or so, or, there's, or there's a hole in the defense. So that's really important as a lock, knowing uh, your rotations and your the, the job you have to do. Trusting your teammates too. Like say if somebody messes up, you rotate for them and trust somebody to rotate for you. So you always worried about the next man and the next man will worry for you. So. Make sure you communicate with your team and your pick and roll defender. Telling him, you know, are you keeping the point guard middle? Are you gonna keep him wing? Are you playing a side? Are you playing straight up? You know, are, we, are you hedging, switching? So there's a lot of like turn Terms, but like it's important to know those terms and communicate with not only the pick and roll defender but your whole team in general so like they're on the same page as you if you're rotating if you're not if you're fighting if you're staying hedging everything communication is very important yeah, at the lockdown position i feel like that's very key just knowing the terms i got middle i got like just knowing where you go and where you're supposed to go and what your job is i feel like the terms are a big thing on defense it's your boy wolf from my hair with sav and we're out of here